everyone, hope you're well. So today's video is an ASOS haul unboxing video. This is how big the box was. I have a shopping addiction, please don't judge me. It includes a mix of stuff that I've purchased that is in the sale and stuff that isn't in the sale and as usual I will leave links to everything down below and I'll also insert some cutaways of me wearing each item so you can kind of see how they fit on the body. Let's get started. First up is this play suit. I am absolutely obsessed with it. It's a bright orange red play suit with like frilly detailing at the bottom, which is super cute. It has a really like deep plunge v-neck neckline, which I like because it shows off some cleavage. And it also has this kind of open bow thing at the front, which you shouldn't tug because if you do, your boobies will fall straight out. But I kind of love it. And I just think it's so cute. I've shown this in my Instagram stories a couple of times and everyone's been like, oh, where's that from? Um, so yeah, I've absolutely been loving this, haven't worn it out, I'm waiting for a special occasion I think. I'm going to take it to Marrakesh with me when I go next month and I'm very excited to wear it out and about in my hotel. Next up is the top which I have really terribly bought in four different colours, I'm so bad. A couple of these were in the sale, a couple of them weren't, but I love the style of them so so much that I decided to get all four. It is this top. It's like a baggy boxy crop top. It has frilly sleeves and like a frilly detailing at the bottom as well and quite similarly to the play suit it has these stringy bits which you can pull open. I guess you could just wear it as a cardigan it wouldn't keep very warm but I like the fact that you can adjust kind of how tight or how loose you want it to be. So I bought it in a lilac shade which I absolutely love. I also bought it in this like bright coral shade it's like an orange pink it's super pretty and i have worn this out and i got so many compliments on it when i did i really wanted it in white but it was sold out in my size for a really long time and i went on asos one day just to have a look and it was in stock they had one size eight in stock so i was like oh I need to buy it and I got it and I love it so much. It's like the perfect classic blouse that I could just throw on and know that I look really, really smart in. And then I also bought, also bought it in a red, but again, they didn't have the right size, so I had to buy it in a 12. I am gonna send this one back because it is a bit too big on me, but because the style is so boxy and floaty, it isn't the most flattering. And normally I like stuff which is a bit baggy on me, but because this is so kind of floaty anyway, I just, didn't think it did me any favours, so I'm gonna return the red, but keep the other three. Please don't judge me or think this is excessive, but it's just like, I found something that I like, I feel comfortable in, that suits me, and it has it in colours, which I'm trying to incorporate more into my wardrobe at the moment, so I went for it. I bought this play suit, which is for, I think it's like beachwear, because it is not appropriate for daily use. It's practically see-through. It's made out of the thinnest kind of cotton material. I love it so much, but I am gonna send it back because I just don't think I'm gonna get any wear out of it. It has a couple of straps at the front, which I really like because it accentuates your bust area, which I'm a big fan of. And uh, yeah, I really like it. It's very simple, but it's just too kind of, baggy and see-through and thin to wear out and about every day. Talking about holidays, I purchased a swimsuit. I think this was originally something like £60 and it was down to 30 so I was like, I need this. It's like something that I've been looking for for a long time and I finally found it. It's from the brand Playful Promises, which I'd never heard of before, but it's really beautiful style. I like how it has like an open back with strappy detailing. It did take me a while to work out how to actually get into this and do the backs up because it isn't the easiest to work out. But once on, I really love it. I love the frilly sleeves and the way it kind of hides the tops of my arms, which I'm a little bit insecure about. Love this and cannot again wait to wear it on holiday. Next, I decided to buy a couple of off the shoulder black kind of simple play suits. I love play suits. I think they really suit my kind of body shape and size. I'm very petite and they I find that they flatter me a lot more than kind of like long maxi dresses or midi dresses. And I love tops that are off the shoulder. You guys know that because they hide the tops on my arms but still leave a little bit of like sexiness in there. So the first one I bought is this one. It is 
kind of the most smart looking out of all three. It has this slight boning area around the uh, cleavage, which is very smart, and I feel like this one's a lot more tailored than the others as well. It kind of fits nicer, it's nice and tight, not baggy at all. Um, I like it a lot, I just don't think I'm gonna wear it that often. So let me know what you think about this one. This is also from the band Bershka, which I haven't got any clothes from before, but I really like it. Second is very similar, but it's a different material. It's more of like black cotton, and therefore it's a little bit more casual. It has a nice like flappy detailing at the front with some buttons down it as well yeah I really like this I feel like it is a tiny too, bit too big for me it's a size 6 and I feel like it like the sleeves almost keep falling down so I'm not really sure about that but I do really like this I think I would wear it but I'd love to hear what you think about it and the last black play suit off the shoulder is one that I have worn out already I'll insert a picture of me wearing it here as well so you can kind of see what it looks like but it's again probably a bit more suited to the beach because the material is a bit thinner but like the red play suit it has frilly detailing on the bottom it has a waistband tie at the front so you can tighten it and I love the sleeve on this one they are beautifully floaty and kind of double layered as well so you get a lot of movement when you wear it I love everything about this one and I think I'll be able to get away with it all year round if I just put some tights on underneath it I can wear it in the winter I forgot to mention this top while sitting down filming the haul but I wanted to insert some cutaways here as I absolutely love it again it's from ASOS and it was down in the sale they still have some sizes available but it's the most beautiful white lace top it's from AX Paris and it has these beautiful bell sleeves as well which I think are so stunning and really make this top something special. It is very see-through so I do need to find the perfect bra to wear underneath it but I am absolutely loving this and cannot wait to wear it out. I bought one pair of shoes from the ASOS sale and these aren't your typical shoes. I kind of feel like it was fate because I saw them and I was like oh I actually have been looking for a pair of shoes like that for a really long time. These the only ones left were in my size so I was like it's fake. But I've only had one pair of nice wellies, they were from Amazon, they weren't that expensive, probably like £40, but they absolutely fell to pieces. I wore them when I climbed two mountains and by the second mountain they were falling apart so I was like mm, probably not going to repurchase them because I didn't get any wear out of them. So I purchased these, they are from Hunter, I've never had a pair of Hunter boots but as I said they were in the sale in my size. They look like this, a couple of reasons why I love them, I love the height of them, they're not too long, I am very short so I can't have anything too long otherwise they won't fit and I also love that it has a heel as well. I don't know if any, like I've never had a pair of underwellies before so I don't know if they all have a heel but I like that in a boot. It has some buckles here and yeah they just feel very luxurious. If any of you have ever owned a pair of underwellies do let me know your thoughts on them especially if you have this pair that's it for everything I purchased from ASOS but I just wanted to show you quickly another two bits I have been doing a lot of online shopping recently it's not good at all but I just realized that I wasn't very happy with my wardrobe and I wasn't wearing much of it so I decided to get rid of loads of stuff on Depop I will leave my Depop name down below so you can go and check that out and I decided to replenish it with a couple of things that I really really love this is from H&M it's again off the shoulder it's like a tight cotton t-shirt and then it has has these frilly off the shoulder bits but they're in a different material so it's like contrasty very nice simple I love that it's not a bodysuit because I absolutely hate having to like do buttons up around your um, crotch area when you're wearing like stuff like this it really annoys me so I love that it's still very tight and that you can tuck it into trousers and it will look very slim and fitted but it doesn't have the body like thing underneath and the final thing is this if you watch my vlogs you would have seen this I bought it from misguided it's like the most incredible sequiny mermaid unicorn dress absolutely love it don't really know why I bought it but I couldn't resist because it's so pretty and it makes me happy when I look at it I will definitely get some wear out of this. Maybe I will feature it in a lookbook soon. So that is everything. I really hope you have enjoyed this haul. Sorry if it's been a little bit boring. I don't feel my chair piece today, which is annoying. I think I'm just gonna go and put the kettle on and have a couple of hobnobs and hopefully that will perk me up a bit. <laughs> but do leave me a comment if you have liked any of the items that I showed in this video. Have a lovely weekend, guys. Bye.